Hi right, gang, Carolina Jackpot Time coming at you on Saturday evening. So, just when you think that there's not a lot of news and nothing's really going on, something's really going on and here comes some news. James Coley, South Carolina, new wide receiver coach, hired about five, six weeks ago, I guess, by Shane Beamer. Abruptly, uh, today we find out that he is leaving South Carolina, where he has never coached a damn game, uh, and is headed to Georgia as the wide receiver coach for Kirby Smart. So, kind of a sneaky, underhanded move there, uh, both by Kirby Smart and by um, James Coley. First of all, here's the deal. It, I'm not going back to work for the guy who fired me. I don't care that he coaches an elite team that has won two of the last three national championships. I don't care uh, really that they can offer me a little bit more money. These guys get paid handsomely. These assistant coaches do. They may not get paid coordinator money, but they get paid pretty damn good money. And so, yeah, will he make more at Georgia than at South Carolina? Probably. Uh, is he probably going to win more games at Georgia than at South Carolina? Yeah, most definitely. Will the job be easier at Georgia than at South Carolina? I don't know. There's not a whole lot of details surrounding this. In fact, most of the article over on thebigspur.com just was like a cut and paste deal uh, that was James Coley's bio. There's not a whole lot there. Uh, I don't know if he's ever signed a contract to South Carolina. Uh, I don't know uh, if he owes us a buyout. Uh, really don't know. Just up and decides to leave. Pull to Mike Bobo 2.0. Um, if we, well, Mike Bobo was actually worse because he actually lied uh, to Shane Beamer and told him he would be his offensive coordinator there back in 2021. And then he just uh, packed up his goodies in the middle of the night and uh, went to Auburn. But yeah, this, this Coley guy pulls down his large, I'm going to say they're large because he doesn't look particularly overweight, size, fruit of the looms, and uh, takes a big old salty shit all over uh, Shane Beamer's quickly balding skull. <laughs> quickly, it's gotten a whole lot more bald and a whole lot more salt uh, to the salt and pepper color hair than what he had when he began to uh, uh, coach South Carolina three years ago, four years ago, whatever it is. It seems like 50 years ago because things that are uh, <laughs> things that ain't real fun tend to say why. But I mean, this, this is just a, another um, in the long line of, you know, I mean, we, we get some elite recruits. We develop a, a player from a lower level school. He bowls. We do this. This one bowls. To me, are you seeing a common theme here? To me, is this an indictment on Shane Beamer? Now, Coley was known more for his recruiting, I think, than his coaching abilities. Henceforth, why he's been all over the world as an assistant coach and hadn't been able to keep a coordinator job for real long. And why Kirby Smart also fired him several years ago because he wasn't a good offensive coordinator. Uh, hell, just listen to Uncle Lou. You can hear him back in the day complain about James Coley and the damn offense they were running back then. It was shitty. So this could be a good thing. So I don't know who is going to be the wide receivers coach, but somebody will want that job, and um, South Carolina will pay them well to do it. It's just uh, it's just kind of crazy the way things happen. But uh, you know, I've always thought uh, that Kirby Smart was an elite coach, uh, elite recruiter, elite program builder, but he's also – an asshole. I mean, you can just look at him and listen to him talk and tell this guy's a prick, and um, he's underhanded, and he's going to do underhanded, prickish things. So, just like I do uh, wonderful, nice, jovial things, because that's just the kind of fellow that I am. But anyway, uh, who cares? It's basketball season, right? Did y'all see them court cocks today? Quarter zip wins again, 72-59 in Oxford, Mississippi, Pull out the broom. We just swept Ole Miss right out of the building for the 2023-24 season. I'll see you guys later on. I appreciate it. Peace, and I'm out of here. Go Gamecocks, baby. Catch you on the next.